Hello everyone, I'm Jezzy and today we're going to stir some tea with The Sims Townies, specifically Bob and Eliza Pancakes. We're going to take a look at what makes them the pancakes, how they've evolved through The Sims franchise, and, you know, add some drama. There's definitely a following for Bob. Eliza gets a lot of hate. Um, a lot of players like to get rid of her in whatever way they see fit. And then, you know, marry Bob. Um, I'm not really... I'm not a Bob fan, but I don't hate him. Um, I don't necessarily play with this household all that much. But... I will say in my game, Eliza's pretty rotten to Bob, um, and we'll go into why I think that happens in a lot of our games, um, just as we go through. Uh, we'll start with Eliza and work through Bob, and then them together, and then kind of how they've become what they've become. They're kind of like one of the uh, poster sims of the game. So, you know, you see them a lot in marketing and when a new pack comes out, uh, it's not uncommon to see Bob and Eliza popping up. So we're going to take a look at that and find out what makes them tick. And they will also have a fabulous makeover because they need it. So with Bob and Eliza, this is a total tale of opposites attract. And Eliza is... Um, she's extra. So, like, one thing that bothers me about Eliza is her outfit. She has a green-white tank top, um, short basic hair, glasses, hardly any makeup on, uh, floods, capri things, and sandals. Now, if she wants to live in a mansion and is, I mean, effectively a gold digger, right? Um, why she got with Bob, I don't know because he's not like that. Um, but that's how I see her as neat, materialistic, perfectionist, wants to live in a mansion. She wants money. Like, she doesn't care about anything else. Why is she wearing what she's wearing? She needs to be dressed, like, fancy. Um, like, she's like some, I don't know, she's super basic. Like, so it was hard for me to keep her basic aesthetic um, when I give her a makeover uh, that I mean then that's kind of one of the things that irritates me about her is just like her outfit she ain't even trying like you want to be you know superstar all up in everybody's business but then you look like you just rolled out of bed so what I did is I gave her more of a sophisticated kind of I don't know, she seems like she's probably got a lot of smarts to her, right? She's creative. She's obviously, you know, working an angle with Bob. Um, so I gave her like kind of like a, a nice little sweater, a black skirt, some tights, and, um, you know, kind of casual it down because she has a casual aesthetic to her. I gave her like some black combat boots that are somewhat fancy. Painted her nails, gave her some accessories and makeup. Nothing too crazy, um, because she didn't really have a lot, so, you know, the basics. Some skin finish, blush, eyeliner, um, kept glasses, but I changed them up a little bit and gave her a better hairstyle that kind of, you know, flows with her face shape, um, and gives a little curve to it. But kept it red, um, red and green, how she is. Not the same tone, because that lime is hideous, but it's better, so... That is what she looks like in my game. All right, now we go on to Bob. Bob is clearly the favorite. Like the whole Eliza and Bob package, because they're so different, it, it really makes it quite interesting. Um, uh, Bob's a slob, gloomy, and a loner. And he married a materialistic, neat perfectionist. So automatically, that is a recipe for disaster, right? And I know Simmers love, like, there's a whole following for Bob, um, where Simmers will take their Sim selves and marry Bob, they'll boot Liza, um, 
Eliza a long time to kill her. So, you know, they get rid of Eliza and they move in on Bob. And I mean, I really just don't think Bob cares. Bob just wants to be happy and well fed and to cook and not screamed at probably. You know, just let him watch TV, eat his potato chips. He's good. Uh, I just, I don't see the pull with it. Like, go for Johnny. Or, um, what's the one dude? Uh, the Dreamer family. Like, come on. Like, Bob's alright, but he's boring. But, I mean, maybe that's what you want. You know, but if you, if you put the package with Bob and Eliza together, they're not boring. But Bob on his own, he boring. So with the makeover I gave Bob, I didn't keep the colors. I wanted to make him a little uh, more like his traits. I kept his hair neat and clean, gave him some earrings, a bracelet, and a, a ring. But I put him in like the total loungewear. Uh, he's got like a, a button up v-neck shirt, uh, sleeves pushed back, comfy, uh, sweatpants with socks and um, sandals with the socks showing. So he's ready to lounge and enjoy his TV and potato chips. So in the Dream Home Decorator Pack, um, they introduced a new little character named Iggy Pancakes, and that is Eliza and Bob's little toddler. So if you saw that uh, trailer and some of the marketing material, you definitely saw little Iggy. So it looks like from, you know, EA's perspective that things are going much better for Eliza and Bob. Um, sadly to say, in my game, Eliza... Well, she did Bob wrong. She, uh, she got with Don. You know, Don Lothario. Um, yeah. So in previous games, Bob is said to be believed to be Bob Newby. Um, and Bob's wife, Bob Newby's wife, was named Betty. And Bob Newby was in The Sims and The Sims 3. Uh, Bob Newby was also uh, lazy and... Um, so, I mean, it all kind of makes sense. Uh, and Betty is kind of the same derivative from Elizabeth as Eliza kind of is. So, yeah. Um, it's interesting. So that, that's, uh, but that's supposed to be what it is. So they, technically Bob and Eliza have been in most of the Sims franchise. If, if you get down to it. So, I mean, it's clear that this is a link to them. Um, how much it is, the, it's not necessarily the same exact sim like the goths, but I mean, you can definitely tell that they're, this was the intention of Bob Pancakes. And I will say that Pancakes is a total better last name than Newbie. Newbie, meh. I mean, you know, it's a gaming term to be a noob or newbie, but Pancakes makes sense for MasterChef. So if you like this video, give us a little thumbs up, subscribe, let us know. If you want to see a certain household, um, I plan on roasting fashion atrocities and poor sim behavior through these. So if you have someone you would particularly like to see, let us know and I will try to cover them as soon as possible.